Having surpassed 1,000 completed anime, it's time to review my old favorites and find out what holds up. I'm Sacrabolic, your Envoy of Hope, and this is Anime Favorite Search. Wanna Be the Strongest in the World specials is a series of six vignettes that can be basically divided into two halves. The first half actually takes place at the farthest point in the show's timeline, occurring at the end of the series, like past episode 12 and is the main character Sakura's mentor basically introducing her to alternate forms of wrestling that are incredibly sexually charged. Starts with mud wrestling, then lotion sumo, and then the last one is like hot bath, which isn't actually a form of wrestling, but it, you get where it's going nonetheless. It's mostly an excuse to show off the girls in titillating situations, and because World Strongest leans towards an older audience, there's just a lot of in-your-face bare boobs all the time. So it's really just there to be arousing. The second half does not take place in the furthest part of the timeline, but I assume that the reason it was structured like that is specifically because it makes for a more dramatic ending to the specials. The second half of the vignettes which is four, five, and six, are a tag match with Sakura and her mentor taking on the, I guess, national Japanese tag champions who are sort of like heel wrestlers from another company that the mentor fights at one point, or I should say wrestles at one point in one of the earlier episodes. And it is divided into a series of three matches where it is best of three. The main characters lose the first match and then go on to win the next two matches, thus meaning that Sakura was actually Japan's tag team champion going into her final match of the show against Elena. The match itself, because the vignettes are so short, are honestly a lot truncated, and so it ends up making less of a back and forth inside of the wrestling matches, and so they're a lot less interesting and engaging than the matches are in the general show. So there's something there for anyone who might be a fan of Wanna Be the World's Strongest, whether you're there for the fan service or the wrestling matches. And I'm not the biggest fan of the fan service in this, but I'm usually not the biggest fan service fan anyway. So who's to say how effective that was? But I will say, as a major fan of the actual wrestling in the show, I do think that the vignettes were pretty weak in that regard. Twitch and Discord in the description. I've been Sacrobolic, your Envoy of Hope. Bye bye!